Supersonic speed? That's old news. Let's talk hypersonic with scramjets. So, what's a scramjet? It stands for supersonic combustion ramjet. Imagine a jet engine with no moving parts, no turbines, no compressors. Sounds wild, right? Here's how it works. First, at hypersonic speeds, air rushes into the engine through an inlet. The shape of the inlet compresses and slows the air down, but it stays supersonic. Next, fuel, usually hydrogen, is injected into this fast-moving air. The air-fuel mix ignites in a supersonic combustion chamber. That's key. The air remains supersonic even during combustion. The result? Hot, high-speed exhaust gases shoot out through a nozzle, creating massive thrust. Boom! You're rocketing at Mach 5 or higher. Key features? No moving parts, works at hypersonic speeds, and it's super efficient because it uses the oxygen in the air. But it's not all smooth sailing. Scramjets need a booster to get going, deal with extreme heat, and have tricky fuel mixing challenges. Picture hypersonic missiles or future space planes. That's the power of scramjets. Ready to fly into the future? Let's go hypersonic!